Yeah. Check this out, guys. What a gas, huh? I gotta use my phone because I don't have a memory card in that. Where you at, Monk? Cheesecake factory. Cheesecake factory. Yes. I did, yeah, but like I said, I do have another camera in the truck, but yeah, you know, whatever. But yeah, it's pretty nice in here. It's nicer than that one we went to. Where was that one at? Orlando. Now this is a lot nicer. The other one wasn't decorated like this. No. Mm -hmm. It just looked like a restaurant. Right. Yeah. Yeah, it's prettier. Yeah. Yeah, this is a lot nicer. Cool. Winter Park, huh? Yep, Winter Park. They call it Winter Park, but it was 96 today. Here in Winter Park. It was no winter wonderland, that's for sure. No. Mm -hmm. So as you've seen, <coughs> we didn't make it to the truck. There was a break, <clears throat> and we made a break for it. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. <clears throat> but the last clip, that's my own music because, it, you know, they're playing music in there, so. <clears throat> but I didn't really say anything, but you get the idea. And, uh, <clears throat> sun was out, shiny. It was 93. The clouds came in, started lightning, the wind started blowing, jumped up to 95. Go figure. But I just checked the cameras at the house, and the sun's still shining there, so we're still two hours away from home. Yes. All right, so if we see anything interesting, I'll kick you back on. If not, we'll see you at the house. Sure. All right, guys, check this out. Look at that cloud. So, we, we was at the Cheesecake Factory. Anyway, I don't know if I said that. But, you have so, an SD card in yes, there? I got an SD card in there. So, <laughs> waitress was really cool. Young girl, probably maybe college age. Yeah. And a uh, real nice uh, server. And so, we got some cheesecake to take home, right? And I'm like, man, you know, I told her we're in a black car. <laughs> it's 93 out, and then it jumped up to 95. And I said, we have no air. <laughs> Turns out she has a black car. <laughs> no air conditioning and leather seats, just like us. <laughs> so, we're twins. So, yeah, <laughs> that's what Monkey said. We're twins. <laughs> so, uh, I'm asking her about these cheesecakes, you know, right? So, I'm like, do you think we can make it? Because I told her we're two hours from the house. She's like, oh man, I don't know. I said, well, I'm a YouTuber. If you're pulling for me, you know, I'll YouTube this. That'll be my personal challenge. So, I said, you got any ice? She said, yeah, we got ice, but I don't, I don't know what we can put it in. I said, you got some, you know, takeout cups she said good idea so she goes and gets two takeout cups and sets them down on the table and what's monkey do dump her drink right into one of them and i was like hun what are you doing i want a nice to go cup she said well this is for my pop to go i said no i said it's for the cheesecake no it ain't yeah it was wasn't it so she had 
<laughs> had to go back and give me another thing of ice. So we're trying to keep this cool enough until we get home. So, well, it looks ominous. Okay, so anyway, <laughs> quick story time there. The, yeah, monkey stole my, so she went and got me another cup of ice. So hopefully it'll make it. Then we get in the car, right? So, you know, we got it that little cooler baggy thing and it wouldn't zip up, you know. So I took, Bruno's got like this pad that he lays on and keeps him cool. So I put that all around there nice and neat, you know, to try to keep the cold air in. She jumps in the car, reaches in the back, grabs that thing, starts wiping herself off. And I'm like, hon, <laughs> I'm trying to save $30 worth of cheesecake here. Yeah, but I have to dry off. <laughs> what the hell, man? So. <laughs> <laughs> we don't want to go home soaking wet. I don't want to try to drive. It's a two hour drive. We'll be dry by the time we get home. So, so I'm like, damn, I'm just trying to save $30 worth of food here, and she's like, I know. And you didn't put it back on there? Yeah, I did. It's on top. It's the best I could. That's the best you could do. Hell yeah. It's not even on the cooler. I got two broken arms here. It's not even on the, it's on the seat. What well, the hell? All right, guys, I got a situation I got to take care of. Hang on. Ugh. Okay, so I figured that out. That bag back there is my leftover pasta. She thought it was the cheesecake. Yeah. So she covered up. Yeah, I'm out. Do you think so? Oh. There's some kids on mini bikes over there. Heading to the gas station. Let's see if I can get them. Where'd they go? Probably headed for the awning. Yeah. No. Oh, they're on motor small mini bikes. Or small. Yeah. Motorcycles, but they're tiny. Okay, Shay Bear's worried about the fish. He says he hears it slapping, so I checked the transmission, it's a little bit low, so we'll have to put some in there. Some transmission fluid. Sorry guys, I have the fan on in here. So he had to go into AutoZone, there we are, AutoZone. So he had to go in there and it's pouring rain, as you can see. Terrible. The guy gave him a raincoat. I thought I was sweet. He gave him a raincoat. Help him put it on because it goes over his head. And then they gave him a final for the floating. That was pretty cool. And I'm going to tell him that, um, <laughs> that I'm recording it. So he's going to get surprised <laughs> when he gets when he gets home and puts this up for y'all. Anyways, I thought I'd let you know. I thought that was a nice little guy. Pretty cool. So, stay tuned. More adventure coming in the rainstorm. And I gotta drive. Two hours. We're still on Winter Park. <laughs> oh my god. Bye guys. Hey guys, so I just spent $100 on a poncho and two quarts of tranny fluid. The transmission's slipping and I smell it. You smell it? And uh, hopefully we'll make it home and I'll have to get towed. I got a poncho. We stopped at AutoZone. <laughs> And the guy grabbed the door for me and opened it because, as you can see, it's still pouring out rain. So I wiped my feet there, and I started walking back through there, and he's like, Be careful, sir. I said, Yeah, I'm okay, and I slipped. And he goes, Walk like a penguin! Walk like a penguin! <laughs> so, you know, I put a cord in here. I don't know. I'm smelling it. You smell it? I smell that when you poured it in. Yeah, that's what I'm worried about. So I had you back up a little bit to see if, it was, if I could see a leak, but you can't tell. But I smell it. So hopefully we'll make it home. I'll be back with you. Look at this jack on.
traffic yeah. when he's doing that. That's how you know a car would come up here to a stoplight. He's turning left, we're turning right. He stopped like three cars back, didn't he? Yeah. yeah. He would not pull up beside us. No, and he, he, he could have. What a coward. And he was just doing it for like 10 more miles, guys. Yeah. Not just blinding us, but blinding oncoming traffic. Now, if I would do that by accident one time, my ass would be pulled over and ticketed. Yeah. But you got an idiot like that. And then she slows down to 45 because the speed limit sign said 45 and he start flashing these damn lights again what a coward he's a coward i hate people like that i took my belt off man i took my seat belt off i'm getting ready to get out she takes off but he's like wasn't he at least three quarters behind us and nobody was there no. he could have pulled right up beside us yeah, he could have. Yeah. but he didn't because he's a damn coward and there was many times he could have went around us and she was not Oh yeah, dotted lines, it doesn't matter. He's just trying to be a bully until he found out I'm taking my seatbelt off. And he, he, he hits the brakes and stops way back there. There was nobody in front of him or beside us. What a coward. What a freaking coward, man. That's when you need somebody. I mean, like Monkey said, what if she was epileptic? Yeah. You know? I mean, when you're doing the speed limit and they're flashing their lights at you? Yeah. Jesus, asshole. Okay, I got some good news and bad news. The good news is we stopped and I got a pack of cigarettes. Actual cigarettes. Yeah, you better hold on to them. Because, um, you know, monkey treated me because, you know, I got out in that little drizzle <laughs> and put fluid in this thing. A little. The bad news is while we was there, Another good thing, it quit raining. But while we was there, there was pretty good light. Plus, I got my phone out and looked underneath. Here's the bad news. I see nothing leaking. Monkey's like, that's good, right? And I'm like, well, in a way, it's bad. Because if I seen a leak, I could say, oh, you know, it's a $12 seal. Pull an axle, throw a seal on it, no big deal. Now I'm up against something else. What is it? Why was it doing that? I mean, it was, we were going 35 and that, and that tachometer, I was watching jump up to 40, or up, jump up to four grand, and we're still doing 35. And she's like, oh, I gassed it. <laughs> yeah, but we're still going the same speed, so there's a problem. So, yeah, that, uh, so I'm not sure what's going on. I'll have to check it out tomorrow. I had other things I had to do. I gotta get done, but, I mean, this is our only vehicle, so. It's, I mean, it's shifting, but it's like struggling to go into sixth gear. Like it's riding in fifth for a long time, and then when she lets off the gas, it'll shift into sixth gear, so. But now it, it seems like it's doing all right now, but what was that? Because I know the tires wasn't spinning, you know, this is four wheel drive. It wasn't, the tires weren't spinning. This thing was going straight as an arrow, wasn't it? So. Anyway, uh, I'll hit you up when, you know, some other idiot tries to <laughs> mess with us. I got a headache because of that, you know? 
and and that's not right especially you know we're doing 50 she's got her flashers on and the sign says 45 she slows down to 45 and before she even got down to 45 which was the speed limit he started flashing his lights again and there were so many places he could have went around us so many so many dotted lines he could have went around us he chose to stay behind us yeah until then he, he didn't think it through though did he Not really. he didn't think yeah you know we're going to come up to a light I know it. You know, I told her. I took. I know. I said that, but I told her I was so in my mind, wishing to God this thing would backfire real loud all of a sudden for an unknown reason. I don't care. That would mean an engine problem, but it would be well worth to look in the mirror and see him spinning out and doing donuts and sliding off into a ditch. You know. Yeah. Then I would stop and say, Yeah, yeah, right? that's good, because I'm about to. You're about to not be all right. You know, flash your lights now, you know? You shot at me. No, I didn't shoot at you. My car backfired and I got it all on video. God, what an idiot. But so I don't know what's going on with this thing. It seems like it's doing all right now. We do feel a little vibration, don't we? Okay, yeah, but you said you felt it in the gas pedal. Yeah. Because I feel it on the floorboard, kind of like, like a wheel bearing. But a wheel bearing will not make your transmission slip. So, I don't know. That's a video for another day, like tomorrow, <laughs> right? So hopefully our cheesecake is doing well. Because we, yeah, we've been a little bit, yeah, we still got 29 minutes to go. All right, back at you. Okay, but when the camera, backup camera is on, that's not supposed to be playing music. No, it's not. Okay, it so was. see? All right. It's fucked up. So, all right, Monk. Yeah. What you say, babe? We made it home, thank God. Yeah, and um, I don't know. It ran fine on the way back, didn't it? Yeah. After we got all that rain, crazy shit. That was nuts. I wouldn't live down there. Forget it. Well, let's check our stuff. Oh, that may be a disappointment. Oh crap. I'm afraid. Here. Um, I think we're all right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, guys. Well, anyway, this is our outro. I don't know why Monkey's leaving yet. Yeah, that's right. Cause you didn't have to get out in the rain. So I'll come to her. Hi. And then we're we're 12 minutes from the house right yeah and i was like hey we're almost i better not say nothing because we're not home yet no more did i say that she was like you see that guy on the road and i'm like what guy there's a guy walking all dressed in black she's seeing apparitions now no i'm not there was a human being he was walking and you could barely see him hey now you gotta walk on the side of the road at night wear something white bright people i don't understand you yeah. so other than that, it was kind of uneventful. Oh, yeah. Just fun. It was fun. Think about yes, it. Yes, it was fun. I like the cheesecake thing. And, yeah. Uh, yeah. I mean, all in all, it was fun. Yeah. Even that idiot, that was fun. That was funny, yeah. Yeah, I, should, I told her I should have got out with my selfie stick and stretched it out long ways and held it like I was holding a rifle. Jeez. Oh, <laughs> crazy stuff. <laughs> People, just drive like normal. Yeah, I mean, it's not like you couldn't pass. And when no. somebody has their flashers on, you are, if there's nothing coming, you are allowed to cross the right. the solid line to go around them safely. Right. So there was no excuse for it. No, you know. and he started a long ways. I mean, I had to go over a bridge and he was doing that. And then It was I like been, 15 miles. Yeah, and yeah. then he, he couldn't go, you know, he couldn't go around at the bridge and but when we got over and got to the stoplight and made a right then he could yeah but the thing of it was and he didn't the thing of it was when he was flashing his lights the speed limit was 55 we were doing 51 yeah. when he started flashing his lights yeah so we were only doing four mile an hour under that's why that one time i filmed 
how fast we were going. That way, if he if something happened, we got pulled over. He couldn't say they were doing like five miles an hour. Bullshit! I no, got it on we camera. We were. I'm sa that's but what I'm I saying. Know, that's know. what I'm saying. I could have proved. He then he's a liar. Yeah. Well. And plus, all you know, he don't know I have a camera. Yeah. <laughs> so I got it all on video. So I was like, yeah. All right. I don't know what's going on here, but then I lost my phone. Yeah, and then I was worried. I thought, oh no, I hope he didn't lose that AutoZone. No, I knew I didn't because I didn't have it at, out at AutoZone. Oh, okay, good. And then you found it. Though. I found it, and then I lost my glasses. You were just having a hard time, and I just kept on where, driving. Where were they? My glasses. On the ground, uh, in between the door and the seat. He didn't. He no, that was the first the time. No, this last time I lost oh, them. Oh, I don't know where you. Had they it. were on my head. Remember? Oh yeah, that's right. They were on your friggin' head the whole time. We're a mess. We just can't can't get anywhere we, without we can't a problem. Go. <laughs> so I was telling her, like, you know, okay, so all, all these YouTubers, you know, they do a will it run and drive home. Will it run and drive 1,200 miles home. They pull this car. It's been sitting in a field for 40 years. They drag it out, put a, put a gas can in it, mm -hmm. and drive it halfway across the country. Not even a flat tire. I can't get us to the doctor and back, so the next trip is going to be, will it run and drive home from the doctor? Uh, <laughs> we can't even make a two-hour trip, and it's not that far. What is it, 70 miles? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. All right, I'm going to say 70 or less, but but, but it's lights. yeah, but it's you know, it's not highway. No. So, so it's not like it's really far. Right. Like you know, on Ohio, you get on one of the highways two-hour drive would put you pretty much across the state mm -hmm. I can't we can't go 70 miles <laughs> well and and we're 20 minutes from the house right mm, yeah. heading to the doctors and I hear this bang 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 flat flat bang I'm like what is it she said it's this rubber thing and this rubber thing that goes around here that I have not fixed yet anyway it's a seal and it was flapping and banging the top of the I said, I'm not going to listen to that for three hours. So I pulled over just to make sure because I was like, well, what if it's a flat tire? So I was like, oh, I, better, I better get over. We just barely made it into the next county and we're not that far from the next county. So he tore the whole <laughs> thing to, off I just so I didn't have off. to listen to it no more. Oh my God. And then it pours rain on there. Oh my God. Okay, that's not so bad unless you have to get out in it. Well, I was afraid of it leaking because you took the dang rubber off. $27 for two quarts of transmission fluid. The cheapest, a funnel, and a freaking trash bag that the guy had to help me put on. Because yeah, I was already wet. Here, I thought he gave it to you. It was being nice. I, oh, by the way, I have a clip in there you don't know about. Oh, great. <laughs> yeah, she was like, oh, that was nice. He gave that to you. I said, no, I'd buy it. Yeah, but he, at least he helped you put it on. Yeah, but, you know, I was already wet, right? Because I got out in the rain twice before that. Right. Well, once before that. Yeah. Well, Getting twice because I went the in the store. They didn't, they didn't have it. They didn't have any transmission fluid, so I come out and, like I said, we had to go across the road, and then it really started pouring. Yeah. So I go in there, and he's trying to help me put this on. He's like, "No, no, no! It's backwards! It's backwards! Let me help you! Let me help you!" And he's trying to pull it down on me, and I'm already wet, so you know, plastic is just right, right. <sighs> had to walk like a penguin. It's been a fun day, guys. That's oh, our vlog. It's an adventure. Yeah, we. It's yeah, never boring. What, what happens when we go out west? All kinds of stuff. Obviously. <laughs> I mean, we can't even leave the county. I know. Without That's having what to pull over. Crazy. <sighs> what happens Absolutely when we nuts. go out west? <laughs> that is to be to find out. <laughs> that that will be interesting. Because we was talking about that last night, mm -hmm. you know, because we're we're both retired now. She was forced into retirement too. Yeah. So. <laughs> She was like, well, you know, we can go out west now. I said, well, think about it because, you know, I mean, we don't have a lot of money, but I said, all it's going to take is your mom to die and some gas money. <laughs> don't that. I know. Don't but she was, that. She, yeah, but she would laugh at it because her mom's funny. Yeah, she's funny. Yeah, she she gets jokes like that. But mm -hmm. I was like, oh, maybe I shouldn't have said that. But, yeah, she would have loved that. But anyway, 
So we got to go in, let Bruno out. She's scared. She's coming out. She's looking around to see who the heck is out here because the ring's going All off. the ring's going off. So she probably gotta... knows it's us, but I told... Look, 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 uh, look, yeah. look, 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 look. <laughs> We're home now. She's fine. There she is. Hope that's not a ghost. <laughs> but it's so... A spirit looking out the window. Anyway, I told her oh at the restaurant, I said... We'll be home about... I have to go. Hey, hang on. <laughs> She's fine. Anyway, I told her at the restaurant we should be home about 10 o'clock. We pulled in. It was coming up here. It was 9.58 when we pulled in. It was 9.59. Yeah, it was. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Shea Bird, Myth, Man, Legend. We're gone for now. Monk. Like I said, she's out. Bye, y'all. Bye, guys. Take care.